First ever footages of the launch of Iranian made and Russian operated kamikaze drones Shahid 136, Garin 2, at targets in Ukraine are now published. The drone was nicknamed the moped for the characteristic sound of the engine. As can be heard, the engine at the rear of the drone is running before the booster ignites. The drones are launched from a simple ground launcher, like those used by the Iranian military and resistance groups in Middle Eastern countries against U.S. forces. Immediately after the booster ignites, the drone takes a sharp upward turn. This method of launching means that the drones cannot be tracked or hunted in any way prior to launch. In addition, the launch method is extremely simple and cheap and requires very few people to prepare it. They can be launched from any point behind the line of contact, or even deeper in Russia's mainland as they can fly long ranges. This drone has a delta wing shape. It resembles a smaller Shahid-131 and differs mainly in wingtip stabilizers. It uses a Mato MD-550 piston engine, developing 50 horsepower. This is an Iranian copy of a German Limbach L550E obtained by Iran in 2006 from the German company. The engine in the Shahid-136 was reverse-engineered by an Iranian company called Ajaparvaz Ma Du Nafr, known as Mado, based in the town of Shokuhai in Qam province. The engine is at the rear and pushes the drone forward. Maximum speed is around 185 km per hour. Exact range of this drone is unknown, though various estimates range from 1,000 to 2,500 km. Flight ceiling is up to 4 kilometers. The Shahid-136 packs a high-explosive fragmentation warhead. It weights around 36 to 50 kilograms. So in terms of explosive power it outperforms a 155 millimeters artillery shell. The drone has got no remote control. Instead it has a simple inertial navigation system with consumer-grade GPS system using highly likely military GPS signal to strike its target. Operational use revealed that Shahid-136 is resistant to anti-drone rifles and electronic warfare systems. The Shahid-136 is extremely inexpensive. Unit price is unknown but estimates are about $20,000. Actually, this is a small sum considering how much damage such drone can cause to the Ukrainian infrastructures. Furthermore, a surface-to-air missile to shoot down this drone will cost much, much more than the price of this drone. A swarm of these drones can simply expend missiles of air defense systems. This is favorable for the attackers as defender will spend significantly more defending from these drones with traditional methods. This drone can also be used as a decoy for air defense systems for a subsequent large-scale cruise missile attack. Therefore, this unique drone gives the attackers a spectrum of possibilities to damage the receiver and once again underlines the deep thinking and cleverness of the Iranian military to have developed such a strategic and tactical weapon at the same time. Thanks for watching and see you next time.